Hey everyone, Coach Dave here. I am visiting out at Badong Chiropractic. I'm joined today by Tyler and Dr. Sonny himself. We're actually at his office. Um, so many of you may or may not know that Dr. Sonny and his team are our preferred chiropractors for Kenosha. So I just wanted to kind of put a face to the name because we use their name quite a bit. Um, so, Dr. Sonny or Tyler, why is it important that somebody should have a chiropractor and most importantly for CrossFitters, why should we be seeing a chiropractor? I'll let Dr. Tyler take the why someone should um, see a chiropractor. Mm -hmm. And I'll take it the uh, crossplay. Cool. Aspect of it, so. All right. Well, chiropractic is very safe and applicable to anyone, regardless of your activity style. But obviously, you know, crossfitters need a little bit more. But chiropractic, essentially, what we do is we ensure that the body performs the way it's designed to. You got to think of the body and the, and the musculoskeletal system as you know, pulleys working around. So we essentially make sure everything is in place so that you can not only perform physically as you're designed to, but also internally, your organs, the nerves, everything within operates to its optimal performance. Cool. Yeah, and then so the like pointing off of that for CrossFit specifically, um, I dabble in it. I did more in the past, and I dabble in it now. Um, but CrossFit is is unique because it's a wide variety of population, which we see here. Right. right? We we don't just see elite athletes. Um, which is awesome when you see them, but the reality is we're seeing general population, and so are you. Um, there's only slight few that are going to make it to you know the regionals and the games and things of that nature, and that's really awesome when they come around. Yeah. Um, but the reality is we're seeing population-based people, and they need all different types of care. So if we have, say, someone that's a banker that comes in and they start CrossFit, well, they're going from a eight-hour sitting job to all these wonderful crazy movements that you're teaching them well they have a lot of mobility issues and restrictions right so they're going to most likely have some type of soreness uh, associated with the starting of a workout so we need to make sure that they're ready for that so that's our role in in, in the whole endeavor of their, their health journey yep. um, and then you look at uh, say a firefighter or a police officer going in and they're already occupational athletes and they're moving they're not going to be injured as much but they have more abuse on their body True. right so you have to make sure you're tailoring their care and every adjustment is different every treatment plan is different for people that we're able to tailor in and that's what we specifically do here we're not just gonna do the same thing on everybody we're gonna make sure that they're getting a specific adjustment associated with their body their response pattern and what they want to accomplish at the gym as well too. Yeah. and that's why it's very important for us to partner with yeah. chiropractors who know what they're doing and, yeah, uh, yeah. Don't just do a cookie cutter type exactly. adjustment, right? And, nope. and Dave's been amazing with chiropractic as well. So you understand chiropractic, you understand our treatment style. Um, uh, Dr. Tyler is certified in active release technique now, which is a huge value add for people. Uh, soft like tissue uh, <laughs> release. Um, Dr. Anna, my wife, is scaled back. Uh, we like to have a lot of kids, I guess. That's, that's part of it. But um, she's an elite provider, and we wanted to make sure Tyler uh, was trained on that. Mm. Awesome. And it's uh, it's a cool system. You can look it up. Active release uh, techniques. Yeah, that's what we work in. Kind of the yeah. myofascial, right? right? It's myofascial. Yeah. It's it's musculoskeletal based. It's an it's an adjunctive therapy to an adjustment. So we're not just going to do ART on you. It's just not going to happen. Like our our theory and philosophy and outcomes are adjustment based. Cool. And then the active release speeds up that recovery. It's a soft tissue re the remodeling. Process. That's really awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then lastly, why is it important? Do you think that we get on chiropractic a little bit more quicker, I guess, as opposed to waiting till there's an issue. Sure. That's yeah. kind of something we see, and I try to get people to understand, like, I see, you know, I've seen you every other week, um, or Coach Eddie as well, sure. but, like, just making sure you stay on top of it as opposed to waiting for an injury to happen. Then it's like, oh, now i got to go see a chiropractor, and I'm on that aggressive. For sure. And I'll start, and then I'll let Tyler finish. Um, biggest thing, like, uh, research shows two weeks of an injury, you're going to have soft tissue laying down and soft tissue really when you look at tissue fibers they should line up parallel and they should move like so when you get injured they're going to glue together and restrict right so that's going to create movement patterns that aren't associated and you go to do a snatch and you're not moving right then you're going to have a cascade effect of other injuries so making sure that your soft tissue is properly aligned and your nervous system is communicating to that soft tissue from the brain removing subluxation patterns you're going to be set up not to get injured in the future prevention um, that's the number one key that we see. Absolutely, and that's kind of what I was going to touch on a little bit as well. You know, simply put, it's easier to keep small problems small. 
Oftentimes, by the time someone is experiencing pain, symptoms, things like that, the actual issue causing those symptoms has been there for months, years, possibly decades prior. So the comeback and the rehab from that, on top of them maintaining it down the road, it's a lot more work to, to be reactive instead of proactive. So it's always easier to stay on top of your health and stay on top of uh, you know, movement patterns, things like that. So you said right there, stay on top of your health, stay on top of your movement patterns. Guys, thanks for visiting with us. Mm -hmm. um, you guys, they're going to be coming around to Kenosha a lot more with our Wellness Saturdays when you guys are available. So you'll be able to come down and talk to them, get to know them, ask them any questions you have. And then again, um, our preferred chiropractors for Kenosha. Awesome. Thank, Thank you. you guys. Thanks,